What's up guys, my name is TechNobber here for Troubleshoots and today I'll be showing you how you can restore from a Windows Restore Point. If you'd like to know more about them or how to create them, make sure to click the link down in the description below and it'll take you to an explanation on how to create restore points. Hypothetically, something goes wrong and you'd like to restore from said restore point, you might be confused on how to get there. There's a couple of ways to do it. We'll hit start and type in restore. You can hit the recovery tab up here, head to the configure system restore, and then hit the system restore button over here. After reading this and making sure that you know what is going to happen, you can hit next, select a restore point, I'd say click the newest one, and then I'd hit scan for affected programs. Anything you've installed since you created this will be listed here, as well as drivers. Some things might break, or drivers might break, and those will be listed down here. These top ones will be permanently deleted off of your computer when you restore, and these ones down here might not function properly, and you'll need to either reinstall them or repair them using the installer off of the website that you got them from. So, it says it cannot detect anything, I'll go ahead and hit close, and hit next. Then, after hitting finish, your system will be restored back to the time of your previous restore point. I'm not going to do this currently, so I'll go ahead and hit cancel. Note that your PC will restart once, possibly twice, and it will take some time to do. Make sure that you do not hit the power button, unplug it, or mess with the battery, or anything similar to that capacity, because it may cause some damage to your personal files or installed programs that were listed there or weren't listed there. Anyways, stay safe. I hope this helps you. My name is Mean Tech Number here for Troubleshoots, and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.